hi guys welcome to my channel when it's abigail or girl or jerry first time here and if you're right and subscribe yeah yay so today i'm going to be showing you guys how i put occur on my hair this is the first time i'm going to be putting occur on my hair though so but before we continue make sure you click on the subscribe button below if you haven't done that yet put the notification icon as well so you will find when a new video comes up give me a big thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comment section thank you so that's all i washed my okra then after that i chopped the okra after chopping i put it into a pot then i poured the um, okra pour added water then i boiled the okra then i'm going to i pour the okra the boiled okra into a um a sieve i used um a wee cap as a sieve so this is how it looks like then i allowed it to cool down before i start pressing the juices out or the juice out <laughs> okay so after doing that we have our occurrences <laughs> You can see how slimy it is. So I'm going to be pouring into an applicator bottle. If you have an applicator bottle, you can use it. Well, I'm using this bottle because it also serves as an applicator bottle. <laughs> it's a lotion bottle, but I just use it as an applicator bottle. So I'm just going to be adding the okra juice on my hair bit by bit so i'm sure i have gotten it in almost every part of my hair and i'm just going to be using my fingers to work it into my hair so and i'm going to be I'm going to use my fingers to detangle my hair so that i can have the aqua juice in every part of my hair um there's so many benefits of um okra juice I, I, um it has some vitamins that help the air it prevents dandruff and it helps with um your curls it's it improves the curls so many things you can also use the um okra gel has um a normal gel to gel down your hair before a ponytail or just something you just want to gel your hair down why you don't have to gel you can use your car so i've seen so many so many tips on okra you can also do your research so i just decided to try this time around because i'm somebody that <laughs> i don't really like putting stuff in my hair just picking something up and just put it in my hair but i just decided to try this okra because i saw so many videos and it was looking so cute so i decided to try it so this is me I just putting it all around my hair in every section of my hair even on my scalp so just helps it fit so there's so many benefits of okra so after adding the okra we're still going to be doing the same thing then after adding the okra and finger detangling I used um a white wide tooth comb to detangle also so i just after detangling then i use a detangling brush also to detangle my hair i think that was where i kind of made mistake maybe maybe not but it just it just that uh, by the time i was true i didn't want to i didn't want to have a spoiler last year <laughs> but <laughs> by the time i use my detangling brush um i feel i felt it's it's reduced the curls should i say it that way yes it was not chunky like the way i wanted it to look like it's kind of okay, it detangled it and made everything to spread out i wanted it to look chunky i wanted the curls to be, be chunky on one side but didn't work so i decided to use it as so this is how the okra gel looks like if you're going to be using it as um to slick down your hair or something so you can see how slick my hair looks just by brushing it down and you can see them curled yeah yeah baby <laughs> the scars are bam it's just so cute 
then tips for when you're using aqua gel please make sure you cover you're not putting on a white shirt or a colored shirt that would keep your stains i made a mistake of using a white shirt for while i was working so when i was off camera i realized that my shirt was stained and so i used um, a scarf on it but still the scarf was moving around so i would advise use maybe a black shirt or a shirt that you don't wear out <laughs> and <laughs> definitely not your favorite shirt <laughs> so this is how it is so i just decided to do a flat twist in front and it was almost getting dry here you can see that it was just looking all fluffy <laughs> it was looking fluffy <laughs> yes it was looking fluffy and not chunky but this is how it looks like almost dry um so you can see these things on my shirt it didn't it's it came off but i had to scrub with my hands for some of them to go off so that's it for this video if you enjoyed this video as much as i enjoyed making it so if you did give me a thumbs up make sure to subscribe click on the notification icon so you can when a new video comes up give me a big thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comment section so to my next video bye kisses <laughs>